welcome back. We are now on part two of the Perusal 1.1 integration with Canvas. Now I'm going to talk about grade sync and pushing grades back from the Perusal gradebook into the Canvas gradebook and how to create assignment links from Canvas so that it takes students directly into that homework in Perusal. So as you can see, I already set up my course and I set, I set up one example assignment. The first thing I'm going to want to do before I create links into in Canvas, I want to go to my settings. I want to go to scoring and I want to check out LMS grade sync. So this dictates how and when the assignments are pushed back to Canvas. So first and foremost, you have the option to automatically sync individual assignments back to the LMS gradebook. If you have this, that means you're gonna to wanna to create an assignment specific link for every homework you have in Perusal in a module in Canvas. So each column in the Perusal gradebook will push back to the columns that it needs to be pushed back to in the Canvas gradebook. You also have the option to automatically sync students' average scores back to the LMS. So this means that, say you have 10 Perusal assignments, we will only sync back the average score of all 10 assignments back to the LMS Canvas gradebook. So you'll only have one column for perusal in your Canvas gradebook. It just depends on what you prefer. We also have manually sync assignment scores back to the LMS. So this just means that you dictate when the assignment is pushed back from our gradebook to Canvas. And then if you don't want that, you can always just turn off the sync. So for now, I'm gonna talk about automatically syncing my grades back to Canvas. I'm gonna press save. And so here is my example assignment. I want this assignment and all of my assignments in the future to sync back to my Canvas gradebook. So first and foremost, I am gonna say copy full title for the LMS so I can create my assignment specific link. The title in Perusal with 1.1 integration must match the title in Canvas, so that's why I press copy full title for the LMS. Then we are going to go into the Canvas course modules. All right, so now I'm back in Canvas and I copied the title from Perusal. And so what I'm going to do is go to my assignment module and I'm going to press add assignment. I'm going to paste that name from perusal into the assignment name here because again in order for the sync to work and for the link to work it has to be named the same thing next you can make sure the points match what your points are in perusal and then i am going to do submission type this is really important so i'm going to do by external tool and it's gonna say, find the external tool URL. So remember, we already installed a perusal. I'm gonna make sure this is loaded in a new tab, and I'm gonna press find. And I'm gonna see perusal right here, so I'm gonna connect it like this. And this is the URL that is always gonna pop up right here. And then I am going to press save and publish. So I'm gonna test that this link works. I'm gonna show you right here. Here it is right here. So in order for, if you have the assignment, um, each assignment passed back from Cam, or from Perusal's gradebook to Canvas's gradebook, students need to click through every assignment link that you want to sync back into Canvas. So right now I, as you can see, I launched the assignment specific link from Canvas and I'm taken directly into the assignment. If it takes you to the assignment table of contents page instead, that means you didn't build the link right. So just remember to have the name be the same and the submission type is by external tool. And then you click perusal and it should take you directly into the reading. It should also take students directly into the reading. Um, just to remind you too, in order for, if you're doing the all assignments get pushed back from Perusal's gradebook into Canvas's, you have to create an assignment specific link for every homework in Perusal. And students have to click through each of those links in order for their grade to sync back into Canvas because it creates a bridge between the two platforms. 
um, yeah. So now we are gonna talk about if you just wanted to sync the average grade back into Canvas. So you're gonna go to settings, go back to the LMS grade sync, and let's just select this to automatically sync students' average grades back to the LMS. If I do this, that means all I have to do is have one generic perusal link in a content area of Canvas. Even though I would have it in the sidebar of my Canvas course, like we installed initially, that link doesn't allow you to push grades back to. So that's why we have to create a link in the assignment content area that students can launch one time and their average grade will be pushed back. So I'll show you how to do that. So now that I'm back in Canvas, I'm just gonna add that average grade sync button to a content area I'm just gonna do in my assignment area again. It's the same process as creating a assignment specific link, but since I'm doing the average, the name doesn't have to be the same. I'm just gonna say approval link. And then the submission type is gonna be by external tool. I'm gonna to make sure it loads in a new tab and I'm gonna select approval from my listed tools. Press save and publish. And as you can see here, my link for the average grades to sync back is here. Uh, I highly advise if you're going to do this just to have students launch the link from a content area. You can always hide this navigation sidebar link if you prefer just so they can focus on launching the link from a content area. And to do that I'm just going to disable just disable the sidebar navigation link and press save. So if I was syncing just the average gradebook column from perusal to Canvas, then students, all they have to click on is the one link from Canvas and their average grades will sync back. And that's the basics of GradeSync and Canvas 1.1 integration. If you have any questions, don't hesitate to reach out to support at perusal.com.